Texas offense. No, they're very good. Their O line is probably one of the best we've seen all year. Quarterback, he does a lot of good things. Uh, he's athletic enough to move around, get his problems, but he's, he's accurate and he gets the ball out to a uh, number of good receivers they have and they run good routes. Uh, and really, I, I think this is the best running back we've played all year. He's, he can do it every, he can do it all, and they like him. They like, like throwing the ball to him out of the backfield. He's a powerful runner. He's fast. Uh, once again, we got our work cut out for us uh, defensively. You can't key on the quarterback, can't really key on the running back. How do you kind of balance with, with who you're trying to shut down? You know, we, we got to just kind of focus it on, on us and do our things right. Uh, just little things of uh, tackling. We did some live drills uh, this week uh, of tackling, you know, just to get used to uh, uh, get kind of back to fundamentals. Uh, so really, it's, it's about us when it comes down to it. Some struggles in the you know, third and fourth quarter recently, except for fourth quarter of last game, zero points. What was the difference? Uh, the difference was uh, Coach Brom and the coaches, they emphasized uh, finishing. And we, we've been talking about it all last week. All this week is uh, we've really, we got to learn to finish. And we did that last week and made some plays and won the game. Louisiana Tech's an offense that's really struggled to get get going at the start of the game. What have you guys got to do to really wreak havoc to start things out? You know, we got we got to come out and play with our hair on fire and, and play with a lot of passion, fired up. You know, when guys make plays, we got to get excited instead of just, you know, looking right back at the sideline uh, for the call. We got to get a little, you know, excitement before we, uh, like, you know, get, get lined up again. Uh, yeah, that's what we got to do.